How goes it, viewers? Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment, doing another interesting walkthrough of a GTA San Andreas mission. CJ has now finally established a partnership with Woozy in Las Venturas, and they plan on taking down the um, competing crime families. One of them is stealing from Caliglia's casino. But in order to do that, it's pointed out that CJ needs to obtain some high explosives. So CJ decides to go down to the local quarry and, well, appropriate some explosives. Let's get on with this explosive situation. <laughs> the glorious sound of a hole in one. Great shot, boss. Thanks. Not bad, Woozy. So, the Sindaco family was behind the attempts to sabotage our venture. I wonder why it's only them and not the others. Probably ain't just them. Rule of the streets, don't snitch. What we need is to hit the Mafia Casino. Yeah, go jack the place. Hey, hitting a casino isn't like gangbanging. It's a whole different league. Yeah, you right. It'll take some planning, but I'm down. She always wanted to pull a heist. What the? Ah, bad luck. Listen, you're gonna need a crew and some special equipment. Yeah, it'll take some explosives. Always gotta blow up shit to pull a heist. You know what? There's an open cast mine southwest of the city limits. They must have explosives. I'll go peep it out. CJ must go to the nearby quarry and steal some high explosives. This mission seems straightforward enough, but can be, um, how shall I say, somewhat difficult because it is a timed mission. And if you don't gather the explosives quickly enough, you lose the mission and have to start over again. I'm going to fast forward to the quarry where the mission starts. Getting down to the bottom of the quarry is, well, how shall I say, pretty easy. You just kind of, you just have to kind of um, drive off the edge and get your car to the bottom of the quarry. And unfortunately, not as easy, but at least I'm close to the dump truck. And you just jump off, you take a little damage and get into the truck and start crushing boxes to pick up the dynamite. Now these guys are going to come at you and you can shoot them if you don't waste time hiding under the, under the truck here, but you drive the truck around, pick up the dynamite, and again the guys may come at you you got to pick up four sticks of dynamite in time. So I'm going to continue on with this mission here and finish it out. Who's this asshole?
You don't have clearance for this area. Where's your safety gear? The truck's size makes it a little, little difficult to drive around in tight areas and under short obstacles, but you do have plenty of time. In this case, um, I got CJ to just barely make it, and once he grabbed the last stick of dynamite and jumps back into the, into the truck, uh, security shows up. And I don't understand this part. I know GTA wanted to make things, or the makers of GTA wanted to make things more exciting. You have to ride the dirt bike up the conveyor belt system in order to get to the top of the um, quarry and escape. Well, CJ just could ride his ride the dirt bike up the trails to the top of the quarry, fighting the the guards. I mean, CJ shoots a guard right there, and he can shoot all the other guards. But instead, you have to go through this whole follow the arrows trail, and it can be very frustrating because you can overshoot, undershoot, land wrong, and yeah, like this, I fell short, so I'm going to transition to the next level. Okay, the good part, once, unless you fall off the cliff, you can start the next level, and again, you gotta go through all this stupid conveyor belt stuff, riding around, up and down, and you can end up screwing things up a little bit, because you don't have a lot to really kind of keep you confined, and you gotta have a very straight line, and once you get up, and you try and be careful, you fall through. So again, I'm just going to transition over to the next level. Sorry for skipping through this. I really don't have a lot of hints for it, where the reality is you still have to shoot a few security guards at the end here. And if you play this mission, you can understand how frustrating it is because you have a very narrow path in which to operate the mini bike and you can fall off over under shoot this is where CJ leaves the quarry to deliver the dynamite to the drop off point and this whole mission kind of made me say yeah this is a clunker in an overall great game but I digress and the drop-off point isn't that far away. Delivery for Woozy. Hey, you be careful with that. Now you can do the quarry submissions. Ooh fun not um well the thing is you might need to do them in order to get 100 percent but they are not critical to the game uh i can take the sanchez down to easter basin to export but i won't this overall was not the most fun mission very frustrating if you play it you'll find out for yourself. I'm Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment. Please keep watching. Um, I have a stinger at the end here, and don't forget to watch to the end of this video where I advertise my wonderful webcomic, Kid Spider Adventures, or Teen Spider Adventures, over at my website, barstoolentertainment.com. As always, thanks for stopping by. Five seconds.
It's a detonation! Three, two, one! 